What up, America? We got, uh, what, Deshaun Watson, uh, Carson Wentz. Um, we got a couple good topics. Me and Doug will go hop on here in a second. You got me? I got you. All right, cool, cool. All, All right. right. What do you want to hear first? The Sean Watson? Hey, hey, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I got a little treat for you. I got a little treat for you. This We ain't discussed this off air. This is a little treat for you. That little treat for you. What you were talking about earlier? You said you were trying to get. What you say you were trying to get? Oh. <laughs> what you say? You hey. Got, you got the plug. Hey. Hey, I had these for my 11th birthday, bro. 97, bro. If you ain't have them 97, you don't need them now, Playboy. <laughs> Let's talk turkey. Let's get into this Deshaun thing. All right. So. Where does he land? Go ahead. Where do you? Where do you think he lands? I, I have no idea. Does Miami open it back up? Are the Eagles – basically, I would say <clears throat> any team that was uh, just in the running for Russell, Russell Wilson should just shift all those picks over to this one. They said the Eagles getting... and the Colts are going hard. Ooh, the Colts. The Eagles and the uh, Colts but... are going hard, but – Okay, but do you trade your court starting quarterback not only in the in conference but in division? Come on. Yeah, that's true enough. Yeah, that's true. And I don't even know if they had the firepower with what they had to give up to get Wes. Exactly. And even if you do that, you're talking about like it, it's gonna be something crazy, like three first round picks. Um Jermaine, I just don't up? think they can do it. Right, facts. But I will say this the fact that he acquitted and he not missing no jail time. I mean, he's not going to miss no season time and going to jail, bro. He might get suspended for what, five or six games. Man. Yeah, for sure. He this That whole thing should have been avoided. Avoided. If you're in Houston, you're, you're a black starting quarterback for a franchise, go get with James Harden. Go to <laughs> Man, I, hey, I'm, the Blue. I'm going to tell you what. I'm gonna tell you what, if if, it's, if it is true, dudes are weirdo. Let's put that out there, cause I, yeah. I heard I heard some pretty graphic details. I'm not gonna repeat on air, cause I don't feel comfortable. So yeah, yeah. you better shut this live down so quick. <laughs> but yeah, if I were, they said that boy I mean, was he's already, that he's already passed that. Whether, whether he did it, whether he didn't do it, um, now he can play. Now he can get back on the field. Uh, the Colts should be a player, but I just don't think an in-division, in-conference, in-division trade of a starting quarterback would happen. Um, they said Philly go, go I think hard, that bro. Philly goes hard. I think Philly Philly has the the draft capital though. though. With three, for, I mean, do you package those three first round picks of this year for him? But they, uh, Dave, I was here later today. Pittsburgh, really. I was here at Pittsburgh. Uh, behind behind that offensive line, he's he's gonna be running for his life. But hey, you need a mobile quarterback with that line, bro. I mean, you you saw Big Ben d- d- got racked up every year for the last five years. Yeah, Ben was getting his his, his goal cracked in every game. So you put a Deshaun Watson back there, somebody that can run around a little bit. You know what I'm saying? But. I'm I'm just looking at all of the dominoes because once Aaron signed, <clears throat> that stopped Denver from, from pursuing him. I'm sure the Steelers. Uh, then Denver got Russell, so now right Philly, Miami, uh, even the teams we're not talking about like Carolina is going to be a player. Uh, this is crazy. So let's let's go with the hypotheticals for Deshaun. He signs with Philadelphia. They're not keeping Jalen okay. Hurts, so is he included in whatever trade? Does he go to Houston? I would, I would think so. I would think so. Yeah, because they would have to get a quarterback back. I, I would think, but if they have an eye on uh, the the kid from Ole Miss, um, Kenny Pickett, 
Malik Willis, any of those, you could draft all, two offensive linemen and that quarterback together. You, you could, they could realistically have four first round picks in this draft to make that trade in Philadelphia. That's facts. That's facts. That's facts. But yeah, we're we're gonna keep we're gonna keep an eye on that situation. I don't know. I can't call it. What you think about Carson Wentz? Uh I think Carson Wentz single handedly destroyed his career in one season. <laughs> what? Indianapolis Colts. Can you, are el- the most, can you elaborate on that, please? The Colts are the most Super Bowl ready team. All they're missing is a quarterback. Like their weaknesses are qu- quarterback, period. They fixed their kicking situation with the kicking, uh, the rookie kicker out of Georgia. Uh, offensive line is amazing. Defensive line is amazing. Uh, T. Higgins had a down year, but he's uh, – I'm sorry, T.Y. Hilton had a down year, but they still have the the second-year wide receiver out of USC. Um, Pittman. Jonathan Taylor emerged. He he hit his stride. He's the top running back now. Like, there's – That's Leonard all they're missing. Defense. And when I'm uh, living here in England, when I talk to Colts fans, I always tell them, Look, you can't keep doing the whole plug-in veteran quarterback, go for the Super Bowl. Phillip Rivers, boom, swing and a miss. Second year, right. swing and a miss. They did draft a right. quarterback, but they obviously don't believe in them if you're going after every quarterback who hits the market. True enough. But, I don't know, what do you think about him? You think he has a a chance to to take the Washington job. I mean, you you care more about that than, than me. I mean, that's your account, that's your division. As a Cowboys fan, what do you uh, think? He's he's automatically the second best quarterback in our division, and you can do with that as you will. I'm I would take James Hurts over him. I'm taking I'm taking James. Uh, 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 probably not. I probably not. I probably not. I'm taking Wentz. I would go Dak, Wentz, Hurts, Daddy Dimes. Let me uh, let me ask you a question. Who's who? Who do you think is the better conference, the AFC or the NFC? Better conference? It, it, up until yeah. like last year, I would say, but has been the NFC. You think it's the NFC? Jalen yeah. Hurts. Jalen Hurts got his team to the playoffs in a harder division to you. Then Carson Wentz didn't get his team to the playoffs in a lesser division okay. by your standard. So you tell me who's better. Wow, that's how you gonna do that, bro. I so so I so just he, look, I just so set Carson the table Wentz, for you. So Carson Wentz single handedly so Carson Wentz single handedly in a team sport lost to the Jaguar. And that was you so that's all no, it was, it was so that's all no Carson Wentz. Okay then, so don't do that. Don't do that. I'm just putting the facts out there, man. All right, man. So what's up with your boy um, moving along? What's up with your boy uh, James Harden, man? Disappointing me, man. He looking like big game James in the playoff, James Harden. Like, he just kept running to the basket, trying to get fouls. He was flailing it. I was like, bro, they not calling the foul for you, bro. You look stupid. It's getting blocked. It's transition bucket. Dance on him, step back, pull up from 30. Like, I know you can. Like, goddamn, bro, what's going on with Harden? James Harden is who people like you think LeBron James <laughs> is. You've always, you've always had this narrative okay, about yeah, how Okay, yeah, we've been waiting for this. We've been waiting LeBron for this. Him, yeah, I forgot how he to get just, into this. Go ahead. How he just leaves the team. He just goes where he we want to go. There's a difference. When you force a trade, when you gain 20 pounds over a week and go out there looking like Sherman Clunk to get your way out of a team, and then the next week you're ready to go. I just don't. You go from OKC to Houston to, like, when, where does it stop? Now, listen. The OKC to Houston deal was, uh, that was organic. Okay, see, so picked a buck over him. Okay. They traded him. Okay, we can't fault him for that. That was not James Harden's fault. But I agree. I don't like how he's forced this way off a of team after team. I don't like it. I don't. I don't. That ain't how I get down. I'm not vouching for that. So I, I don't want you to think I'm defending that behavior. I don't. I don't. That ain't a good look. But I'm saying, 
can they deliver a title to Philly? Tobias Harris. Title? Tobias Harris, NB. Yes, Hard and NB. Tobias Harris, Maxi. I think they got a chance only because um, <clears throat> that vaccine, uh, that mask mandate doesn't get lifted in New York. I, I'm not taking any Nets team where you're only going to get, you know, Kyrie for how many games? Well, let me ask you this. Right now, the Nets are the eight seed, which means they would play four road games versus four home games every series, which means Kyrie would play the majority of games, every series. That is true. That's, I mean, I didn't think about that. You got me. You got me. You got the wheels turning now. I'm, I'm not saying you want to be the eight seed, but I'm saying as constituted as it is, they get the eight, seven, six seed. The majority of their games will be on the road to the unless they advance to the finals. So, who do you have uh, coming out of? The East. You know what, bro? Honest to God, you think I'm gonna go? You Chicago? think I'm gonna go with the? Uh, you think no, yo? No, 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 no. You think I'm? It's not bad, bro. I like what Boston got going on, man. I like what Tatum was doing. I like Jalen Brown. They got the best defense in the league. Smart score crazy. I Horford, I like the basketball that Boston is playing right now, bro. I really like it a lot. Tatum is going nuts. He's not getting talked about enough. He's young Kobe out there. He's young Kobe with Curry shot. He's pulling up from thirty in your eye. I'm telling you, bro. I like Boston. You heard that here. That's, uh, that's I can't talk. I give it to you. It's a hot take. What's you know what seed they are right now? <laughs> I think they top four. I can see it. Uh, I don't think Chicago's getting the respect they deserve. And uh, Bro, they, they, I think everybody's arguing about Philly, the Bulls, the Nets, the Celtics. At the end of the day, you got to knock the champ off. So I'm not counting. I can't count them out either. Okay. <laughs> okay. Do Phoenix get back to the finals? No, absolutely not. Who goes to the finals in the West? Uh, if AD can come back healthy. No, no I'm joking. I'm joking. Please I'm joking. stop. No, no, no I'm like uh, to say, don't, don't if do I'm being completely honest, I would have to say uh, Phoenix or Memphis. You think Phoenix Memphis can make that run? You think Memphis got it at all? I think they can, but. Um, they really need a more consistent second score. They're going to need somebody who's going to be like co consistently getting a double double. I can't, uh, off the top of my head, I can't say who the second court score on their team is, but I think I that think they. Oh boy, uh, Desmond Bay. Yeah, so I think they got a shot. Okay. Okay. Hey, if Memphis made it to the finals, that'd be a good look for the league. Just to have a different team, bro. Memphis, Boston would be awesome. Awesome. Yeah, shout out, to, shout out to Memphis, great city. I was, uh, I was at the game where, uh, what's his name, Luca did the under and the lean and hit the buzzer off the backboard. Bro, when we got off the phone, bro, I saw your boy. You probably gonna see this all over Facebook. Uh, the Joker, bro, he came down the court, put the ball behind his back, spun, spun off the same pivot like he did two full spins off the same pivot, came around, finger rolled it, bro. It was, I never, I, you gonna see it all over the, all over Facebook, bro. I'm gonna have to look that up, but we got one last thing to get to. Okay, let's get to it. Okay, so this sparked from uh, the game, the Drink Champs. He said he was a better rapper than him. I immediately okay. called you. You called me. We talked about it. We I'm talked on the game it. side. You're you're on the Eminem side. Speak your piece. I, wait. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Listen. I'm 
talk of that thing is. Skill wise, skill straight up skill, <clears throat> rapid wise. If I had to pick, I think it'd be a tough battle. I'm gonna go with Ev. Put like this: Ev does things I don't like. Style like like you said that ram ram ram. Like I don't care for that. But I don't like Gabe's name dropping, bro. I never like Gabe's name dropping. It irritates me. It irks me. Like, why every bar do you have to drop another artist's name? So, they both have negatives, okay? But they're both elite MCs. Now, who's better? If I had to pick, I would probably pick him. Now, in a versus, I remember the other day, I came to you and I said, I don't think Gabe has the hits to go up against the Ilk. Right? And you said, okay. you know, Ilk El- has hits, but his hits don't appeal to, you know, the people who tune in the verses don't want to hear the real so shame. You know, I, I get what you're saying. We don't want to hear how my name is, the people that would usually tune into a verse. You want to hear this is how we do. That crowd will go crazy with that drop, right? Okay. You got a point. Exactly. I understand you. I understand what you're saying. So I think Gabe probably would win the verses. I'm gonna be fair. I think he would win the verses. You changed my mind. You changed my mind. Okay. So I changed the mind. I do have one more. I I do want. Go ahead. I'll let you go. But I do have one more to pick with you after this. Go ahead. Okay. So here's my thing. The artists that we grew up on, um, him late '90s, early 2000s era. At that time, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. I'm not listening to some dude talk about killing his mom, raping his ex girl. Like it did, it just didn't age well, and that's the biggest problem. Okay. All, on top of that, when you're such a recluse of a person, like you don't see him out and about, you don't see him on any interviews, you don't see like I don't, I don't even understand what growth he's had. Hold on, I'm getting to it. But artists like a Jay Z, a Nas, even a Snoop, like I get records from them now that are stories about where they were at in that time. I just don't know why did I never get that from Eminem? Why did I never get like him being introspective on like talk about talk more like about your drug addiction in a real story, not just okay. rhyming orange, 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 orange. But, uh, okay, well listen. But listen, so I want to get to your first point. The first day out of your mouth when you said about him killing his mom, raping his ex-girlfriend. But sh- do you still listen? Can you still listen to DMX? Uh, if, if I'm being honest, I was never really the biggest DMX fan. But so what I'm saying, though, you wouldn't group him with Eminem, though. No. So so let me say this. So let me, I'm glad you, you said this up for me. So, DMX can say, I got blood on my hands and there's no remorse. I got blood on my, because I'm a corpse. But everybody else said something about killing his mom. Is that not in the same vein? So why is it cool for DMX to talk about stuff like that? But when everybody else does it, it doesn't age well. DMX said, if you I'm not daughter saying, older than I'm me, not saying it's okay. I'm saying that's what he so did. Saying, but I'm saying then, it's a standard. It's a standard. I don't like that. I don't like it. I don't like that. DMX is talking about raping corpses and you got blood on his Johnson. Uh, talking about if you got a daughter older than 15, I'm going to tie you to a chair and rape her in front of you to ask her seriously what you want to do. Like, come on now. I, I, can't, I can't say nothing about that. But he also didn't continue to try to make that same music. Now, my next point, your next point, you may, I'm going to shoot some holes through. You're right. You're right about the about the 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 real slip shadies, the high my name is, the uh, guess who's that? But that was a formula, dub. All of M's first singles were the cartoonish singles to get you to get into the album. Like his every first single was like high my name is, the real slip shadies, guess who's that? They were always the cartoony goofy first single. You guys act like that's all this album was, bro. Like, what that song I sent you today, bro? That wasn't goofy or funny, bro. Like, he got plenty of songs like that, bro. See, for the but most, it, rock but how many people know that song? How many people know that song? 
if you, if, if you get into his albums, you gonna that's win. A, that that song couldn't beat three hundred bars and run it. It couldn't beat this is how we do. Could it? No, it could not in a verses. But I'm Thank saying you. y'all act like all the dudes do is make goofy records. I just think that I'm not trying to. Dude, he he has stuff. You can't. All I can say is my words are like a dagger with a jagged edge, and I, you gotta stop there because it's gonna be so much. Tone. <laughs> you gotta go fight. Thank you. <laughs> you gotta go Thank fight, you. bro. All right. Bro. But I don't. But I don't want to. I don't want to. Uh, I want to clear it up. I think he has an amazing rapping ability. He can rhyme ridiculously, but post post adolescence, like post, you know, once he got his life together, he matured. There was no music to match or reflect that. There was nothing to say, hey, this is where I'm at. It was terrible. Like all the relapse and encore like you can keep absolutely all of them. The dog shit trash. Recovery. Kabakazi. Don't play me, bro. Just because you just because you don't listen. Don't try to make it seem like that's where it stopped. Okay, he had some good shit come out after that. It, those albums are like Jordan's after the Bulls. Like it's his wizard years. They'll never bring it up. Like you got to play. You ask me. I can't push back on that. I can't. I can't push back on that. That's about a fair analogy for that. I will give you that. That's that's the biggest thing I'm asking for. Is I I just want the growth. I want to be able to like okay, like even even with Jay Z like. I grew up on Big Pimpin'. Like, he's not even talking like that no more. I will but say I still that. rock the music. It's still good music. That was one of my big knocks against Jigga. Like, that's one of my big knocks against Big, but I guess we can't, I can't judge him on that because he ain't lived long enough. But that was one of my big knocks. Like, but but he but he do it now, though. Like, he, he very, very woke and conscious, and he, and he pushed that now. But it, it took him a minute, though. You know what I'm saying? In my opinion. Yeah. Yeah, but that's all I had to say, man. But I'm about to get up off this live. I got to take some more meds. All right, bro. Get better, man. We're going to do this again. Some more info drop, man. We're going to get on here and talk about it, man. Hey, till next time. All right, Peace. bro.